how to overcome asthma. Over the years of study, I've realized that most health problems are encouraged or the response to the foods that we're eating. Foods and your environment will greatly influence how you feel. But most of us don't realize that many of the foods that we're eating daily, our body is responding to as an allergen, causing great amount of inflammation. Welcome health nerds, thanks for tuning in to Health and Fitness Nerd. I am your host and your nerd, Steven Ayala. Please hit that like and subscribe button and hit that bell to be notified when we have new videos. As a CrossFit athlete for many years, I had a battle exercise induced asthma. Having this added complications to my training, making my workouts twice as hard as I struggled for air. Finally, after many years, I decided to see the doctor and he's prescribed me an asthma-related medicine which didn't improve my breathing and left me back to square one. So once again, I was left to my own research on why and how asthma affects the body. Asthma is a condition in which the airways narrow, swell, and produces extra mucus. This can make breathing difficult and trigger coughing, wheezing, and shortness of breath. Asthma is a minor nuisance for some people, but for others it can be a major problem that interferes with daily activities. What causes asthma symptoms? Asthma varies from person to person. You may have infrequent asthma attacks such as when exercising or having symptoms all the time. Asthma attacks can be worsened by a respiratory virus such as a cold or a flu. For some people, Asthma signs and symptoms flare up in certain situations like exercise or workplace chemicals or the typical allergy season. Now for some people it's clear why they have asthma and for others maybe due to a combination of environmental and genetic factors. Exposure to irritants like airborne substances such as pollen, dust mites, mold, pet dandruff, respiratory infections, physical activity, cold, air, smoke, stress, and some types of food. So how to cure asthma naturally and permanently? So what helped me reduce and in time eliminate asthma from my life was the avoidance of certain foods, environmental toxins, and consciously making better lifestyle choices that aligned with my goals to be a better athlete and healthier overall. Number one, avoid all foods that cause inflammation like high fructose corn syrup, trans fats, fried foods, white breads, pastas, soybean and vegetable oils, uh, processed foods, table sugars, trans fat vegetable and seed oils, refined carbohydrates, excessive alcohol and sugary drinks. And number two, add these foods decrease inflammation like broccoli, turmeric, nuts, green tea, ginger, beets, whole grains, oily fish, dark chocolate, berries, avocados, cherries, apples, pineapples, bell peppers, beans, garlic, olive oil, and coconut oil. Number three, avoid or decrease all foods that cause mucus buildup in the body, like red meat, milk, whey protein, cheese, yogurt, ice cream, butter, eggs, bread, and pasta, cereal, uh, bananas, cabbage, potatoes, corn and corn products, soy products, sweet desserts, candy, coffee, tea, soda, and alcohol beverages. Four, foods that decrease mucus like salmon, tuna, sardines, flounder, pumpkin, pumpkin seeds, grapefruit, pineapple, watercress, celery, pickles, onion, garlic, honey, ginger, lemon, cayenne pepper, olive oil, and decaf tea. Eating more of these good foods that I mentioned eliminated my asthma and only on occasion I find myself eating some of these bad foods, that's when I find myself with more mucus in my lungs and a hard time breathing during workouts. It's pretty simple and I hope this works for you as it did for me. Thank you health nerds for watching. Please like, subscribe and hit that bell to be notified when we have more videos and leave a comment below on what you would like to see on up and coming videos. And for more details on these subjects, check out my blog at healthandfitnessnerd.com. And to help maximize your health with daily detox, check out cellgenicstore.com. Remember, health is wealth. See you guys.